Alhamdulillah wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad Rejoice and praise your Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala Especially if he has guided you from darkness into light Whether you were born a Muslim or whether you came into light by, by a conscious decision and a choice to come into the true and pure faith The only faith that recognizes who the Lord of the heavens and earth is Who created you and I and who gave us the, the, the purpose and the true fulfillment of our life. This only comes from Allah. And this will only come through true actualization of this. And a true realization of this will only come by embracing Islam. Walhamdulillah. And we ask Allah the Almighty to bring about benefit from this video and make it something that opens the heart of those people who listen. Don't listen to the people who say, uh, who claim that Islam is uh, a terrorist uh, religion or a faith based on terror, a faith based on prejudice and hatred. But look into Islam yourself and you'll find the exact opposite. You'll find that the, the, the principles that are espoused by Islam, that are contained in the Quran and the Sunnah of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, are the principles of true peace peace of mind and heart and more importantly your soul where your soul is going to end up is it going to end up in internal uh, being damned inter uh, eternally or is it going to be in Jannah in the paradise which all of us want to go to paradise and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in order to to make, uh, to, to emphasize this point, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, أُولَٰئِكَ عَلَىٰ هُدِمْ مِنْ رَبِّهِمْ وَأُولَٰئِكَ هُمْ مُنْمُفْلِحُونَ Allah tabarak wa ta'ala says in the Quran in Surah Al-Baqarah that verily those, Allah is talking about the believers, verily they are those who are on guidance from their Lord. They have guidance. Ahlul Islam, the people of Islam, are a people of guidance. They are people to be followed, not to follow. And they are those who are successful, meaning that no one else is going to be successful. You're only going to be successful with the light of Islam. So look and investigate. What is the meaning of Islam? Islam only calls you to worship the one true God, the only one worthy of worship, and leave off all other deities. Embrace that brotherhood and worship him and him alone. That's all Islam is calling you to. Follow the example of the prophets, alayhim afdal salatu wasalam, because verily they were chosen by their Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala and they were revealed the same message. Allah says in the Quran, وَلَقَدْ بَعَثْنَا فِي كُلِّ أُمَّةٍ رَسُولٍ مِنْ نِعْبُدُ اللَّهَ وَاجْتَنِبُ تَعْبُوتِ And verily we have sent to every nation a messenger to worship Allah and stay away from other deities. This is the simple, humble message of Islam. We're not asking you to come to grow your beard. We're not asking you to come to just to cover yourself. We're not asking you to call you to anything else but to worship the one who created you, the only one who has the right to be worshipped, who all praise and thanks belongs to. He gave you air. He gave you provisions. He gave you another chance to make uh, tawbah and, and repentance to him. He gave you another chance at life. So thank him by embracing his faith. faith. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil, and anything I said that was correct was from Allah. And anything that I said was incorrect was from myself and the shaitan, wa sallallahu wa sallam, ala nabiyya Muhammad.